January is National Human Trafficking Awareness Month in the United States. January 11th marks the official National Day of Human Trafficking Awareness. Even with the term human trafficking becoming more of a buzzword in the past few years, many people still don't think it's a big deal or that it happens in their own community. The truth is that human trafficking happens everywhere, and everyone has the power to recognize the signs and report it. But many people don't feel they are equipped enough to tell if what they are seeing is in fact human trafficking or know how they can go about showing their support. Hi everyone, I'm Maria from eTactics and today I'm going to talk to you about two easy ways to show support during Human Trafficking Awareness Month. Before we get started, make sure that you subscribe to our YouTube channel by clicking the button below. Also, hit that alert bell icon so that when we post new, helpful content, you get notified. Okay, you're ready to help. That's great. You might be asking yourself, what exactly does human trafficking look like? Well, depending on the state you reside in, human trafficking's definition changes ever so slightly. But the widely accepted definition of human trafficking is the unlawful act of transporting or coercing people in order to benefit from their work or service, typically in the form of forced labor or sexual exploitation. Human trafficking can also be categorized as modern-day slavery. The following situations can also be categorized as human trafficking forced marriages, victims being coerced or tricked into organ removal, and forcing children to serve as soldiers or to commit crimes for the benefit of the criminals. Here are some ways you can show your support and help fight against human trafficking. The first step, and probably easiest step, in showing your support for a cause is to be able to fully understand it. Consider listening to podcasts that spotlight professionals in the anti-trafficking movement. This form of content provides listeners with direct access to experts in their respective fields. For example, we've worked alongside the former Department of Justice Director for Human Trafficking, Bill Wolf, to produce our Human Trafficking Awareness podcast, Rush Hour, The Congestion of Human Trafficking in America. Making sure that you're getting your information from a reputable source is key. I'm sure that you're familiar with the power of social media. If not, well, welcome to the year 2023 where everything gets shared on the internet, sometimes for the better and sometimes for the worse. However, positive support for a cause can go a long way on the internet, especially when drawing attention to an issue. For example, if you were scrolling through your Instagram feed on June 2nd, 2020, you likely came across many accounts posting nothing but a black square with the hashtag Blackout Tuesday. This hashtag represented an entire social media movement. It was used in solidarity towards George Floyd, Ahmaud Aubrey, and Breonna Taylor. This movement led to millions of participants. Even if you're not an influencer or have a massive following, you can make a positive impact on social media by spreading awareness. Following a human trafficking awareness trainer, government official, or nonprofit leader as a step in the right direction. Some popular hashtags used for raising human trafficking awareness are hashtag and trafficking and hashtag NHTAW. Participating in any form of human trafficking awareness could potentially save a life. As one of the most lucrative criminal enterprises in the world, it will take all of us coming together to fight against it. You're already on the right track by joining me in this video. If you'd like to learn more about how to fight human trafficking, reach out to eTactics. And you already made it this far into the video, so you might as well like it, share it, and comment below.